that although we see often the tracks of quite difficult to actually see the animal at the times that we do safaris. Now what you'd notice is immediately the fact that these are quite elongated toes. Quite elongated toes. There is the presence of a claw there. But the dead giveaway for this track is the fact that the back of the pad, this is the planter's pad, has this extended lobe out the one side. So basically it looks like that. So long elongated toes with claws and a back planter's pad that has this lobe on the one side makes this the track of a white-tailed mongoose. And in actual fact, this white-tailed mongoose walked down the road in this direction. Sometime, <clears throat> probably last night, they are nocturnal, which means they, they do walk around at night time hunting for insects, little nocturnal beetles and worms and caterpillars and all that sort of thing. And quite often we see the tracks of these white-tailed mongoose. I'll be honest with you, they are actually quite interesting things to see. It's the largest mongoose species we have here. Probably weighing in at around about 10 pounds, about 5 kilograms. Big fluffy white tail <clears throat> that tapers down to this point and has this amazing habit of bounding around. It'll jump, walk and jink in these funny ways. So sometimes these tracks can be a bit confusing, especially when these white tail mongoose get their energy going up. Tell you.